So what is going on developers, my name is Mehul and welcome to this video in which I'm excited to announce a very good response from GitHub, a very good news from GitHub, that is it has made all of its core features for free for everyone. Now what do I mean by that? Now you can go ahead and on GitHub you can create unlimited free private repositories even in your organization handle which gives you more sophisticated control over who controls the repo, who has read write access, all that stuff. So you have unlimited public private repositories both under your handle as well as um, under your organization handle. You have unlimited collaborator support. You also get 2000 actions per, per month for free action minutes that is. And honestly speaking, I did not really know that GitHub actually supports continuous, in continuous integration and deployment out of the box. So you can actually have all of that stuff right centralized into a single platform. Right now I use Circle CI for code dam and I pretty much like it, but this is very, very interesting. And I'm, I'm really thinking to consider moving from Circle CI to GitHub because I have crunched the numbers and 2000 actions uh, minutes per month compared to 2500 credits per week, which Circle CI gives for free. It's, it's more or less like coming down as an equal bet, I would say. So yeah, for me, it's better if everything is central at uh, a particular platform so that I do not have to really jump around here and there all the time. And yeah, that's what GitHub has made possible now with this update. So you can see now that you have all these features. You can go to this page and see that all the features you get for free. For the features which are not free, I really, really think that these are for the companies, the big companies or people who won't really actually mind as well for paying this. So GitHub has really come along a long way from having even paid repositories as paid, uh, sorry, not paid repository, even having private repositories as paid to everything free. And this is, I think, one of the biggest contributor to that is the Microsoft acquisition of GitHub which I believe is a good thing because Microsoft has been pushing open source a lot, no matter what everyone says on uh, forms like Reddit or anywhere, Microsoft has been doing work in open source. And obviously we cannot forget, like Microsoft has done some things in the past, but well, the present and future is what matters for now. So another thing I believe GitHub, why did they did that is because a lot of people actually started moving to GitLab, which had a very, very similar plan structure like GitHub, or actually GitHub had made it similar to GitLab now. You see on GitLab, you get the features which we were talking about right now, absolutely for free. And this was um, before, um, you know, GitHub made this announcement. So GitLab had been doing these features for free. So, you know, um, I don't know why, but GitLab is not really, uh, GitLab is popular, but it's it's not really that popular than GitHub. So if you rank the sites, GitLab would definitely come below GitHub in terms of, you know, maybe number of repositories, number of users. So yeah, that's that's one thing GitHub has right now in its favor and it is using it in the best possible way. That is the momentum. GitHub has the momentum of developers right now. And before more developers migrate to sites like GitLab, because of the lucrative features they offer, they have basically made it the same. Also, you might have observed that GitHub has dropped the price to $4 as well, just like GitLab has the same price. Previously, this was $9. So there you go. They have matched it with GitLab here as well. So yeah, I mean, it's competition is a good news for customers, but GitLab might be a little bit in trouble here. So let's see what, um, they have to offer what, what they'll bring for the platform and uh, hopefully competition would lead to like the best of everyone. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. If you liked it, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you then in the next one.